Dornillo port of entry could see more use very soon. This after talks between cargo transportation leaders and officials in Juarez and El Paso recently took place. And leaders from Ciudad Juarez are telling ABC7 that the maquiladora industry will decide when to start sending more trucks through Tornillo soon. ABC7's Juarez correspondent Ediberto Perez has the story. The Tornillo Port of Entry, a bridge over 40 miles east of El Paso, has not been used as expected since it was opened. Safety concerns and lack of infrastructure were the main reasons of that. But business leaders and officials on both sides of the border want to move operations there if other bridges are closed. Nosotros mismos decíamos, ¿y qué nos va a cuidar? Manuel Sotelo with the Mexican Chamber of Cargo Transportation said, business leaders and maquiladoras in Juarez used to ask, who will take care of their safety and what are the Tornillo Bridge's capabilities? They were not sure how this bridge could operate until. Nos dimos cuenta que Tornillo tiene capacidad. Un día y se hicieron 650 y tantas exportaciones por Tornillo. He said in September of last year, when CVP shut down commercial operations at the Bridge of the Americas and the Zaragoza Ports of Entry, in one day they crossed over 650 exports, a number close to what other commercial ports of entry see daily. Sotelo also told me since then no criminal activity has been seen in that area of town due to the presence of Mexican authorities. With future planned modernizations at the Bridge of the Americas and the Santa Teresa Port of Entry, business leaders expect to have these bridges closed for commercial traffic for over a year. No podemos dejar morir tornillo. ¿Qué dice la autoridad? Sotelo said they need to use tornillo if these bridges are closed. According to him, U.S. Customs and Border Protection has told them that if a certain number of trucks are not crossed through Tornillo, they could pull out officers due to a low activity at this bridge. In Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC7. Thank you, Ediberto. The county of El Paso also told ABC7 a construction firm in Mexico is offering incentives to maquiladores and transportation companies to cross through Tornillo more often. They're also providing them with discounts at the toll on the Mexican side of the border at the only highway to get to the Tornillo Bridge.